John Ranger from Techno Buffalo here. Generally, I keep personal information out of this channel. I save it for Inside John's Mind, but something sort of important came up that I want to share with you. Starting tomorrow, which is March 17th, I am off to Asia. I will be spending 10 days in Vietnam and Hong Kong. Uh, six days in Vietnam and four days in Hong Kong. Uh, I'm going because I'm getting my master's degree in MBA to be more specific. And as part of that program, they sort of send our entire class on what they call an international residential. Um, we sort of study international business and do some consulting for local businesses there. So I have never been to Vietnam before. I've never been to Hong Kong before. I have been to mainland China, though. Um, so I'm really looking forward to it. I think it's going to be uh, a lot of fun. But I wanted to share with you guys uh, the fact that I was going to be going because you may see a bit of a lack of content uh, between now and a week and a half from now. Uh, I do have a few videos that have been queued up to be uploaded uh, between now and then that you'll see sort of pop up. But my daily content will resume when I return on just about the 29th uh, or 30th. It is a 17-hour flight from Southern California. I'm going from LAX, which is Los Angeles, to Tokyo, and then Tokyo into Ho Chi Minh City. I'm going to Vietnam first. And it's a 14-hour time difference from Southern California to Vietnam. Um, I don't know what to expect in Vietnam. I know it's very hot there. I have no idea what to expect in terms of the economy, the people, the culture. I'm going in relatively blind. It's either going to be a good thing uh, or, or a bad thing. Uh, Hong Kong, I'm really looking forward to. Like I said, I spent a little bit of time in mainland China, uh, but never in Hong Kong. I'm looking forward to also the electronics. Um, I will be picking up sort of a ton of cool uh, Asian electronics if I can, something that we can't get here in the U.S. and show you guys when I return. Um, if you do and you are curious about what I'm going to be up to while I'm in Asia, I will be doing uh, pretty regular updates on my other channel, uh, Inside John's Mind. I'll put a link to that in the sidebar. Uh, in case you guys want to keep up and check out, you know, how things are doing. It's going to be a, a big adjustment, I think, going to a country like Vietnam. Um, I, I've spent a little bit of time in, in a few other Asian countries other than China, um, but, but never anywhere near Vietnam. Um, you know, I don't know what to expect. If we're still going to see some residuals from, uh, from the war, if it's going to be very cosmopolitan or metropolitan. Uh, I don't know. So if you guys ever been to Vietnam, are you from Vietnam? Um, I'm going to be mostly in uh, Ho Chi Minh City, um, but I will have a few days sort of explore that I'm not there working. Uh, I think it should be a lot of fun. So hope you guys sort of enjoy the content coming up, and I hope you will um, not forget about me while I'm gone. And uh, there's a lot of exciting stuff when I come back. The iPad's going to come out, and you know a lot of cool new things. And I will be bringing back a ton of sort of Asian exclusive stuff that we can't get here in the U.S. Uh, to share with you. So anyway, guys, for at least for the next 10 days, I'm John Rettinger from Techno Buffalo, and I am off to Asia. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. So for those of you guys that stuck around through the video, I want to share something with you. Um, I am going to bring my MacBook with me to sort of document the travels, but of course the power adapters are different uh, in Asia than they are in the U.S., so I went to my local Apple store, and I picked up a world travel adapter kit. If you guys have ever traveled abroad and you want to bring your... Mac laptop with you, something that you're probably going to want to pick up. Um, it's just about forty dollars. I'm not really even sure what comes in here. Hopefully, the tips that I need for my MacBook. And it's actually pretty neat how this works. This supports uh, multiple wattage. And all you got to do is pull off this top part, and these pieces in the box slip right in there, and it make this work in a myriad of other countries. So this is—I uh, didn't think this unboxing merited its own video, but I thought it could be kind of cool as. Um, as an add-on to uh, the traveling video. So let me go ahead and open this up here. These things are quite adhered on. Go ahead and rip that off, hopefully. There we go. So let's see what we get. Looks like you have adapters for a ton of uh, countries. It looks like all over the world. This will be handy for those of you guys that do a lot of traveling. Um, I don't do that much traveling, but when I do, it's going to be nice to be able to take my computer with me and not worry about blowing it up by using one of those non-supported converters that aren't really meant for electronics. So World Travel Express Adapter Kit, probably not going to look at that. So let's take a look at some of the tips. Um, and also one cool thing that they do do is they include a USB adapter that you can use to charge uh, your iPod or your iPhone. I'm be bringing my iPhone with me. Uh, so that's sort of a handy thing. It sort of scales down the power. So slide this thing off. And I'm able to, as I would think, slide this right on. Although I'm not so sure 
Looks like the piece actually, you take the adapter rather, and that slides on. Like that, and turns it into uh, a little, you know, whatever port thing you want in the end. Uh, kind of neat. Let's take a look at some of the other adapters that come in the box. I think this is UK, not entirely sure. Perhaps if you guys are out of the US, you'll see your adapter share. And if you want to know more information about this, you can check out Apple's website. A ton of different tips for, again, different countries. Let's see what all the power adapters look like in different parts of the world. So here's another uh, US one. I sort of just threw that in the box, wasn't really in any particular spot. Here's out of that one. I don't know what that one's going to be for. Um, we've got a few more tips. That's kind of interesting. And there is uh, the US one. So anyway, guys, that's it. Wanted just to uh, share this with you. Hope you uh, enjoyed. Hope you guys have a nice uh, week and a half. And I will talk to you when I get back. See you guys later. Bye-bye.